Okay guys, let's try this again one more time. Welcome to this video and hopefully Premiere Pro won't crash. So I thought I would do a Thanos inspired makeup look. Now don't you dare comment, spoilers in the comment section for Endgame. I know I'm late to the party, but whatever, ignore it. This shirt is also from Darling Darlings. She's so sweet. I met her at my last convention and we did an art trade. I got two t-shirts and she got two of my prints. Oh, she's so nice. Please go follow her on Instagram. Um, but let's start into this monstrosity I created. It, it's literally a monstrosity. So, and my hair, I know it looks super oily, but I swear to you, I had a shower before doing this since I was going to town. So yeah, that's right. I went to town with this makeup on. Gems and everything. So the primer I use is Tatcha. You just saw it. I'm slow. This is the Creaseless Concealer by Tarte. I hate this stuff with a passion, but I love it. I, I really missed the shape tape. I feel like it did better. I like the liquidy consistency of it better. I feel like I got more product with it, but you know, it's not sold anymore. So, and I don't know if today it was just because my beauty blender was kind of already dry when I started filming because I had wetted it and I would cleaned it before filming but I guess since it took me a while to get everything set up and then I apparently had my ring light on way too freaking bright um <laughs> it just kind of dried it dries really fast which you can see I'm not happy <laughs> with the consistency of this so I reach over and I grab my shape tape concealer that's 50 million years old i've had this thing for two years maybe three i know i really shouldn't be using this anymore considering how old it is that's not healthy but dude makeup's expensive and i like i said i hate but i love the creaseless concealer i mostly use my shape tape concealer now as um a crease cut whatever you call it thingy majig where you take concealer and then you put it over your eyeshadow and it gives you this really cool looking thing. I can't do it. I try. I really do, but I just can't. I'm getting there though, which apparently is something I'm going to try to do here. Now, um, I don't have a lot of purple eyeshadow, um, and just purple doesn't really work for me. It kind of makes me look like I have a black eye. <laughs> so, really, I, I wear a lot of pink, so that's one two uh three four five six and seven well that's a highlighter seven and then my jack and the L has one so like nine maybe ten purples in total that's it now <laughs> That's why I was having a little bit of a hard time in the beginning deciding what I was going to do. But the NYX, what is this one? I got them all over here. NYX Beauty School Dropout. I got this when I was still working at Joann's. Um, I'm going to use some of the creaseless concealer as a primer because I typically use uh, chopstick as a primer for eyeshadow because it makes it stay on forever. But um, I, I didn't feel like reaching over and grabbing my chapstick, so I used concealer because it was right in front of me. I said, oh, hey. Yeah, and then my um, brushes, my 50 million brushes. This isn't even all of them. Like, I'm still pulling some out right here, and that's not even all of them. Um, the reason why I'm having a little bit of a hard time is because in order to film this, I have to spend my vanity around to back my wall, which is a pastel rainbow. Um, so you, I'm basically using... <laughs> <laughs> I'm using um <laughs> return address labels. I know there's literally tape you can use for this. I just happen to have a package of 3,000 package return labels. And they work perfectly, okay? I'm not spending any money to go buy the actual tape or like I thought maybe I could use washi tape. I was like, this stuff works so much better. Uh, that color, that color, what is that color? That's the only yellow, a cream sickle, right? That's it. That, wait, that's it. No, that's not it. Oh, wait, yes, it is. That's cream sickle. <laughs> oh my god, <laughs> what has my life become? So, <laughs> I didn't. Okay, so let me let me just say this. I wear glasses. Anything that's at least like. A foot to three foot away from my eyes that's not like right in front of me starts to get blurry now I'm not like blind without my glasses I probably could drive if it was desperate I don't know what that color is just guess this, this palette this palette's huge but 
it just it gets a little hard for me to actually see what's going on and I had two mirrors I had my big mirror which has a crack in it and then I stole my mom's small makeup mirror and I said I can totally do this not only that but the camera I'm recording with in technology years is probably ancient at this point it is <clears throat> covered in paint right now too. Still has the sticker from when I bought it. This is a Sony camera, a Sony video camera I got in 2012 to go to my very first anime convention in Dallas, Texas, which was Akon. And I paid, I think, 150 or 130 for this camera. This camera now sells for $330. Now, mind you, this is filming in probably 720, I think. Yes, 720. And now everything is 1080. So, I mean, that's literally the only difference between the camera I have and the one that sold out. Again, you're just going to have to guess on those colors, man. I don't know. I don't know. And I don't know what I was thinking when I thought this would work out. It honestly looks more like a sunset. It really does look more like a sunset. <laughs> okay, so I do do sunset makeup looks every now and then. Um, not not this drastic, obviously. You can see like I'm like not even caring anymore. I don't know how many different. I couldn't find like the right shade of purple. I just I kept trying to see if I could you know maybe lather some on, and then I was like, well since I can't really well purple, I'll just lather some gold on it. You know, purple and gold, definitely Thanos and you know go for it you know i this was just like a waste of makeup what is that like 15 30 dollars worth of eyeshadow on me i mean maybe not the nyx palettes but no those nyx palettes were expensive man never mind this is like, uh, what, what was i trying to achieve at this point i i definitely look you know what i look like i look like i'm from power rangers like the original power rangers that's what this is there I am going back in. Why was I going back to that yellow? So oh wait, no, it's not that yellow. It's the only highlighter I use out of that whole palette. I don't know what is that color. What is that? That is in light, and I also use beam. I really only got this palette for faint sissy and little lady, which are the only three pinks in this entire palette, and I wore them religiously for a long time. What am I doing now? Oh, I'm adding more purple. More b bright purple. I don't know what I was doing. I swear to you I can actually put makeup on. I don't know what this is. It may also be because I don't have like my foundation and stuff on right now in this. I tried to be like beauty gurus who put their eyeshadow and stuff on first. And then, you know, put their foundation and whatnot on next. And I can do eyeliner really well, but today it was just not working. Like, it did the first time. I made them really long. They weren't supposed to be that long. Oh boy, this is a monstrosity. I don't even remember like how I got to this point in my life. What is this? Where, where did this come from? Why am I adding more eyeliner? Oh wait, that's the gold part. So this eyeliner, I had actually bought in by accident. I thought I was buying the one with the black gel on the end this one had the gold gel which there's my black gel and after this it ended up getting destroyed i had a lot of black gel left on that one and apparently i was an idiot didn't push it back down in so after this it's destroyed so i don't know what i'm gonna do without black gel eyeliner to go underneath my eyes and make me look emo why am i adding more eyeliner what did i do okay you know what no Let's just um, fix the problem Thanos style. I'm thinking, you know, just just a little snap, maybe? Are you gonna snap? Oh, no. No. Oh, sweetie. <laughs> I'm calling myself a sweetie. Yeah, no, this is a definitely a Thanos snap kind of moment. Um, I'm not sure if I can fix this. Um, yeah, yeah, no. And voila, there we go. That is some actual um, makeup there. I told you I could totally do makeup. Like, look at that. Like, look at those jewels too. So yeah, I went to town wearing this and I was honestly disappointed that no one freaking noticed it. But I also wear glasses. So um, I guess that was the problem. 
I don't know. You tell me. Anyways, thanks for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, hit that like button. If you want to see more, subscribe. And I do post three times a day on Instagram at Mercy's Pastel World. Just, just in case you want to go check me out. I got lots of pictures of my puppies too. <laughs> lots of pictures of my puppies. So, yeah. Uh, pastel aesthetic is life. Bye-bye.